Hey everyone, as you know, the other day, yesterday to be exact, I just got my Galaxy or my Samsung Gear S3 Frontier Edition. This is the one with LTE. I did an unboxing on it and I was saying that um, I ordered an extra band. These bands right here are replaceable. These are the default silicone bands that come with the... Uh, with the watch when you buy it and these are going to be good bands that you can wear for like working out but for like if you want to wear this watch for like say with uh, dress clothes or something like that um, these silicones bands right here might not do it so I ordered this and I'm going to show you guys right now that's what I ordered it's the uh V Moro 22 millimeter solid stainless steel metal band and I got the black version and you can pause that and read it for yourself you can see that it has a lifetime warranty I believe they're the quick release ones too so they should be easy to you know put on and off replace and they got different ones so I got the black one to match with the watch so here is the packaging right here for the V Moro. Just a plain uh, plastic packaging right there. And here is the band. This is the, like I said, the black metallic one. And like I said, you can get it on Amazon for $17.90 with Prime free two day shipping. I don't know if there's a one day free one day shipping or same day delivery. I don't think there is. So let's just unbox it real quick. This is the regular. They have an XL version also on this. And this is just the regular version. So let's unbox it. Okay, so after like removing this tape right here, you just lift the plastic cover off like that. And here's some pins. I don't know what these pins are for. On the Amazon's website, it says it's a quick, quick release, just like the gears band maybe it's for the extra like links right here that's what those uh pins are for so like i said this is a th this v moro um metal stainless steel band is um has a lifetime warranty and so i guess this is the uh warranty card right here and uh a little instruction pamphlet and you get this little like tool for removing the pins I think it's for the links I hopefully it's for the links and it's not for here's some more links right here so let's see I guess I have to put the links in, but it's quick release. So let me go read the instructions real quick and um, we'll go from there. Actually, I don't think I need to read the link of uh, the instruction pamphlet because looking at these right here, at these uh, little pins, it looks like these are the ones that we put for the quick release. As you can see, if my camera will focus, let me take one of them out. Okay, so we get three of these. I think one is an extra. Because you're supposed to get one for, you know, the each strap. So let's go check it out. So these right here is for the quick release. See, you do this for the quick release. So let me go put one on right now. First up, this uh, watch band feels very, it's pretty heavy. Um, I don't know exactly how much it weighs, even, it, we're going to remove it out of the plastic, but it feels pretty like, you know, metal, good construction, and good solid heavy feel to it. Okay, so we got the 
metal band out of the plastic. It's nice and smooth. It doesn't feel like it's going to attract fingerprints. It's kind of like a brushed metal. As you can see. So it's not going to attract fingerprints and it won't really uh, get too many scratches because of the brushed metal. The, the clasp is also, you know, stainless steel, as it says right here. Stainless steel. And so, see, each end right here and right here for the watch band we're gonna put one of these uh, quick release pins and I'm trying to let me try to do this through the camera and see I think it goes like this see so there you go you got the quick release pin right there and um, what I'm gonna do so you get one for each end and also an extra one just in case you lose it so you get three of these right here three of those uh, quick release pins an extra one just in case you lose one and so what I'm gonna do is these ones right here I'm gonna take these silicone straps out it's a good thing I didn't cut my nails yet see so there you go nice and easy Okay, right there. So here is the. Uh, it's touching it. Here's the watch. Okay, so I'm gonna do this off camera because I don't know. Um, it's gonna take too long. This video is gonna take too long if I try to do it on camera. So here we go. We have it on. It wasn't that hard. It's um, these quick release pins make it a lot easier. But <clears throat> if you guys can see, I don't really have the biggest wrist. I have like seven and a half inch wrists. And um, on this one, once you get the clasp on right there, it's a quick release clasp. And so there you go. You release it, and you just close it back up to lock it on. It's kind of loose right now, so I'm going to have to um, remove one or two of these links. That's where this tool comes in right here to remove the pins out of these links. And then you can adjust the, the size. It's pretty nice, but let me um, just remove one of the links and get it really adjusted so you guys can see how it looks on the wrist. Okay, so we're back. So... Man, I had this one pin that just would not come out. Now, they have a very ingenious method. So, this little tool right here, what you do is you line up the watch band with one of the holes where the links are. Like, with one of these holes right here. If my camera would, once again, want to focus. With one of those holes right there. And then... All you do is put it in here like so and then just twist, twist it and then it, the pins will pop out which is pretty cool. So <laughs> I was trying to look for my screwdriver, my smallest, uh, I have this little like pick kind of and I removed this and I almost bent it. Stupid me without reading the instructions that all you had to do was uh just loosen this out Put the strap in line the holes up with the With that part the little pin remover there and then screw it or turn a knob and 
and the pins will pop out so that's pretty cool so this is going to come in handy for like other watches that i have so now let's put it on and uh so there's my rolex watch face that you can get on facer it's an app for your uh gear and uh let's put it on and there we go and it's still kind of loose i'm gonna have to remove another link but there it is that's it so i wonder how the extra large is if this one is just regular and that's it right there on how it looks so this is the uh So this is the uh, V Moro black metallic watch band for the Gear S3 Frontier and the Classic. And um, if you guys are interested in getting it, you can get it on Amazon with Prime free two-day shipping. So that was the Gear, or that was the this is the V Moro metallic black metallic wrist band for your gear s3 frontier and also the classic although the classic if you guys don't know the classic edition of the gear s3 is a uh, silver on here instead of metallic black like this one right here but i don't think it really matters i wish they had one that was black but then it had gold in the middle that would be even more like dressier i guess so that is it. You can get this on Amazon for $17.90 with Prime free two-day shipping and uh, highly recommend it. It's good so far, especially with this tool and also the quick release um, with the quick, quick release pins right there. So that is it. Everybody take care and we'll see you again for another video.